Hello, my friends. My friend from Italy asked me how to get this kind of red color. What I mean, just if you look at our file, let a little bit put exposure up because it's under exposure picture. I prefer to take under exposure picture. Uh, this is normal red color, bright, yes, and saturated. But uh, look at these settings. It's very important how to use white balance. Also, look at these two adjustments, vibrant and saturation. You always can put them uh, by different opposite ways. You see, the saturation, do it now, decrease and vibrance. Or increase. Also, very important is curve, yeah, because if you remove black points to gray points and uh, white points to gray points, also uh, you will use this kind of curve. And you see how it change. Yes, uh, we get this tone. Also about tone. Yes. Here a little bit change hue because a red color was changed by uh, camera cal calibration settings. Uh, as option you can leave it default. You see, if I do it back, I can get uh, very close, not not, uh, not not so bright color, but a little bit changed. Yes, and also. When I change red color in camera calibration, for example, this one, I can correct them red colors here in camera here with the color. But a very important thing is curve, vibrance do more increase, saturation more decrease. And about toning depends on your choice. You can use some toning on all of your pictures. I prefer to use some uh, warm toning here. And also for the shadows. Here I, I used uh, a more cold toning. Yes. So the most important thing is uh wine balance, vibrant saturation, of course curve, and your play with colors and camera calibration. That's all. Thank you for your attention.